I invited eight of my closest friends and created the Bounce House Olympics. Be happy. So we're gonna break up into two teams and the captains will be the people with the highest sub counts. Uh, Jaden and Alyssa, if you'd like to come on down. So you have to figure out between the two of you who has more subs. So Jaden, you get to pick first. Can everyone like touch your toes? Okay, Izzy, come here. Caleb. Caleb. Now when we start getting things in here. <laughs> Jump as high as you can. Uh, Scooch. That's probably because he was tall. Do you want to pick anyone? Deanna. We have come down to the last two. How's it feel? Um, you know. I don't care. <laughs> what about you? Okay. Yeah, sorry. Sorry. Hey, it's, it's, it's a stereotype for a reason. Why? Fat kids always go less. So our first event is going to be jousting. It's going to be best of three, and each team will send three members to face someone else on the other team. So red team, who are you going to send first? Izzy. She has a, a fencing background. We have Izzy versus Alyssa. We're going to say it with me, everybody. Three, two, one, go! Oh! Oh, oh, and that's a win for blue yeah. team. Yeah. I do think there's a stark advantage because if you look closely at Alyssa's feet, I am going to do this to her. She does not have socks on. I just wanted to be known that she's probably one of the smart ones. But I am going to punish her by putting her feet in this video. What? So? Your feet. I have very cute feet. Well, we'll see what the internet Scooch thinks. You're supposed to let the people pay for your feet. Round two. Scooch versus All Tribe. Both competitors have socks. Oh, can we get a close up on the feet? Can we get a close up on the feet real quick? Three, two, one, go! Oh, oh, this is very aggressive. This overextension from Scooch. Come on. Whoa, whoa! He definitely did touch the ground first, but that was close from both. Oh God, it's a little red there. Yeah, no, he hit me in the head. The GoPro had smacked my head. So we have Jaden, lover of birds, and D, also a lover of birds. Let's see who loves birds. Birds. Go! And they both look terrified. They're both scared. This is this is not how you should do it. Oh, oh, Jane looks vulnerable. Oh, headshot and default. And I know this event is a little crazy, but it's made possible because today's sponsor, this one, this sponsor right here. Not only are they helping us keep these bounce houses inflated, they're also helping our athletes keep their energy levels up. With tons of flavors like rainbow sherbet, watermelon, and raspberry iced tea, you will never run out of options for staying hydrated and energized. You can even find this product in tubs, cans, energy crystals, and even limited edition collector's boxes inspired by some of your favorite video games, movies, and TV shows. <gasps> They have tons of cool merch options like t-shirts and shaker cups. And if you click the link in my description or go to this website right here, you can get an additional 30% off of your purchase today. Let's go! So that is one win from Red Team. What do you think right now? Feeling good. I hope we keep winning more. Only one way to find out. Next event is the mechanical bull riding. 1v1 and we might have some injuries. So with both teams having decided a player, we have CJ who's gonna face off against Caleb on the mechanical bull. Whoever lasts the longest wins. And who wants to go first? Caleb does. Oh, three, two, one, go! And it looks like Caleb is holding his own on the mechanical bull who's being a little, honestly a little gentle right now. But we have other plans as I do not expect this to be gentle for long. This is actually rigged. At the 30-second mark, it will fall over. He is designed to think it's easy. We see it speeding up a little bit. But as the timer approaches 30 seconds, he is getting close to his own demise. And there we have it. Go! Everyone has a chance of winning here, except CJ. This one is programmed to knock him off Strictly on the 10 second mark. Did I win? Oh! How long is that? That's a blue team victory! Yes, you won. Yes! I'm salty for you. I'm salty too. Now we're going to move on to our next event Twister. It's going to be 2v2. Last one up wins it for their whole team. We have everyone in position. We are ready to twist. First one is going to be left hand green. No, 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 no. I'm going to do this one. Left hand red. It's getting hard. Do like Caleb's strategy here is very infiltrating the red half the square because Jaden kind of has to deal with a lot of them right now. Oh, we are getting into some 
positions, and I hope that this is not reason to get our channel demonetized. Right hand blue! Oh, no, I you can't share spots! Oh, oh, oh. You're in an unfortunate spot, but that's a fall. You can get off the board. Right foot green! Oh, and that's a fall from Caleb! I gotta ask, I feel like you had some of the roughest positions of everyone. You worked up a sweat, how do you feel? Horrible. That makes sense. Oh, Izzy's balance is shaking. She is barely up. Right hand blue. <laughs> I, I think that I think that's a fall. You did so good. My legs hurt so bad. Do you feel sore? I feel like a dancer. <laughs> yes, my legs are so shaky. So that's it for that event. Twister went on a little longer than I expected. I just didn't realize we had such flexible people in our audience. But we're moving on to our fourth and almost final event the treasure maze. We have four ball pit balls hidden in the maze that correspond with your team's color. You're going to send two people in. Go! go, go, go. Oh. All right. Well, both teams are yeah. off, and I definitely thought I would have a better vision. I did not know we were going to be speeding into this, but I am just going to be scouting on the outside with them. We got red team already trying to bring over, and Jane is lost. All right. So red team, red team, they're guiding them. Oh, oh I think we have uh, assault. Thank you, thank you, thank you. CJ, you got one? I got one. Okay. So everyone is running. Everyone is running. This is a mad goose chase. I got it, I got it. Go, 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 go. Yeah! It's actually, whoa, 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 whoa. Ah! Oh my God, that was fast. Who did it? And if I can think about it correctly, both teams are tied going into the final event. Who could have seen this happen? Who could have been secretly hoping this was going to happen the entire time? I'm going to go tell the other team it doesn't matter what they do anymore. One, two, three. Fuck you, red team. Wow. Okay, one, two, three. Uh, fuck you, fat. For our final event, we have the giant obstacle course relay race. Everyone has to go through it once. They all have a baton. If you'd like to show me. Hey, pay attention. Hey, baton. Yeah, we are starting with Jaden for the red team and Ultra for the blue team. And we're going on three, three two, two, one, one go. Jaden is a little bit ahead on the first leg. Oh, she is smaller and more agile, which helps heavenly right here. Oh, she is storming through the tiny little jungle. And now if I can see down the slide, who's coming down first? This could spell the fate for the rest of the teams. Jaden is down first, handing it off to oh, Izzy oh and God, Ooh, All Drive is nowhere to be found. I'm so large. Oh, oh, and there comes All Drive. If they can have a smoother handoff, they can come up ahead. Oh, they're not even trying to adjust it. Oh, she's just holding it down. That is a- uh, they go anyways. Okay. Find the baton. And oh, she found it. The, the, the baton has been found. Red team, I don't know how. Somehow they pulled ahead again. But it, I think really all that matters is how fast can they hand off the helmets. I think that's a real skill to test here. Easy comes on first. Another red team victory. And look at that. They found the baton that Jaden foolishly lost. Scooge is putting the helmet on. And there is Alyssa handing off the baton and the helmet to Deanna. Oh, she is putting it in the- wow, she is optimal. She has theorized this. She knows exactly what she's doing. Oh my god, Deanna is going- storming through it. I, I haven't even seen Red Team. Where are they? They better ho be- hopefully they have a lead. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is that a blue team success? Did they pull ahead in that? Red Team- oh, Scooch is a little bit behind. But she is locked in the helmet. She can't get it off. Oh my god, they want to win this. Blue Team wants to win. They aren't even trying to figure it out. Wait, this is the final leg, isn't it? This determines everyone. You just want to be as fast as you possibly can for this. And it looks like blue team is ahead, but red team is not. Oh, that's a fall from CJ. Blue team is looking in a mighty good position, but all that matters now is who comes down from that slide first. Oh, that was Caleb. And blue team wins. And you know what, like while we're here, let's give everyone the trophies. Blue team, if you like. Caleb, the anchor, take your second place trophy. Because for the winning team, we have one final trophy and one final event. How do you feel that your team's been disbanded? Personally, have to take them all out? At what? Well, since you asked. Inflated hungry hippos. Hungry, hungry hippos. You guys will all be delegated to the four corners and you have to get the most balls you possibly can in your corner by time being up. You can do whatever you want. You can steal from each other if you really want to. The final event of the 2022 Bounce House Olympics. Blue team all turning on each other. Starting in three, two, one, go! So I know everyone moved before I said go, but if everyone cheated, it's fine, right? Go! 
Oh, and they are fighting. We have balls leaving the pit. <laughs> Bro! He took the entire ball pit, and that created disaster. I see Alyssa, Billy Mason, just throwing everything she can in her corner, and Caleb is trying to steal the... Oh, my gosh. She is hoarding it. He is hoarding it. There, there is an all-out brawl happening over here. Someone is leaving. I think Ultra is, has so many balls because he stole the pit. Caleb is throwing balls out. Oh, my gosh. Ultra tribe is making this as unfun for everyone as possible. If, if I was blue team, I would just start 3v1-ing all tribe. Oh, okay, she is pulling in the weaponry. You know what, that, that's resourceful. I would like to remind everyone that second place gets nothing. So, uh, I would just turn on all tribe, but that, that's just me. Three, two, one, and that's it. Everybody, reveal, oh my God. All right, well, that is the end of the 2022 Bounce House Olympics. Captain Illimation, what do you think of your team, though? I love my team. There's a reason we made it this far and that they also beat me, because they're amazing. Well, that's actually very nice. But All Tribe, would you like to take your trophy as a 2022 Bounce House Olympics champion? What got you this far, though? I have to ask. A mild concussion. Well, I'm glad you signed a waiver. Where am I? <laughs>